Welcome to Upgrade, I'm your host Frank the Tank and today I'm going to bring in some gaming headsets that work pretty much on any system, easy to use, easy to plug in and we're going to take a look at it and see what you get when you purchase this and we're going to put them to the test so let's go ahead and do that. Alright, let's take a look at the headsets. Uh, these are going to look like pilot headsets, alright? When you fly an airplane or a chopper, this is how they look like, they look very comfortable. Uh, if you guys can see there's an actual wheel here, this is actually um don't let this fool you in the back right here this actually does nothing it's only for a static uh, display that's pretty much what it is um the, the actual headset it wraps around in here because you can see this is a flexible headset right here um so this actual microphone will it's pretty flexible um noise cancellation it doesn't have it other than the air wind kind of tunnel so you don't breathe on it and hear that extra noise like dark vader this is what it has uh, the headset actually expands. The actual headset expands through here. If you guys see, it doesn't use the actual flexibility or anything here, but it actually has these wires that you actually have to pull them back. And that's pretty much what you get like that. You set this up on your head. If you guys can see it, they fit well in my head. They kind of cover the whole ear itself. Um, you can still hear some noise out, but it's not that bad. They're not it's crushing you completely like other systems. Um, you can actually control that in the air. It's very simple by either flexing them back in. Now, I like the nylon that it covers the whole thing. And this part right here is very soft, very easy on the head, especially for guy, both guys like me. They need that extra cushion in the back and the top. This is great. Now, one thing I don't like about this headset is that this microphone is always going to be there. There's no way of turning it off and on, you displaying or removing it. It's going to be there. But if you're looking for an Xbox game uh, headset or microphone for a PlayStation 5, you can do this. On the PlayStation 5, you, unfortunately, you're going to have to plug it in directly to your control in order to play for it. And um, on the other consoles like PC or anything like that, this is the same connection. Now, this one is a digital connection that it reacts as a microphone phone and actually as a as a stereo surround sound too so two in one the great thing about this it has the audio controls right in your hand too you got your mute button here your volume control up and down that's pretty much minimum will be to uh, to the right and, and positive will be to the top and it tells you right here with the actual bars so that's not bad let's go ahead and play some games and let's see how we we do with um the actual console game so let's go ahead and play apex on pc all right, first of all, we're going to do a test on the actual microphone. If you guys can see, we have the actual volume control. And the microphone is right next to my mouse, so we're going to put it away from it. And before we even do that, we're going to make sure it, it's actually capturing the microphone. And the way I do it is I always tap it, and if I can see it moving up, it's connecting not from the PC, but it's actually connected from the microphone. So let's go ahead and do that test first. So the actual top of it is right here. You can't see anything. It's right here on the top. And that's where you actually get the microphone in. Right now I see red, so it's really high. I like that it's doing that. And we're going to go ahead and record some game playability and see how well it works. So let's go ahead and do that. He's coming to you guys. He's up on top, 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 top. Got his thank you, sir. <laughs> 